Now we know. Mm. Ooh, trains. And a very good morning to you. It's Saturday and my son's coming up with my grandson. Later on, his wife and my granddaughter are going to a party somewhere, children's party thing, which is fine. So they won't be around on Sunday. In other words though, it means I won't be out for too long today, but the weather seems okay, hopefully. Observation from the observation deck. I have known that the team bean is busy and that the pier hasn't washed away in the night and the nest is still here. Rough seas up by the pier, but I'm not going that way, hopefully. I'm going to be going along the sea wall. Yay! And it doesn't look too bad. Time for crashing up over, it looks fine. You wouldn't believe that when I woke up, um, the alarm went off. It was actually pouring down with rain, splashing on my window. So I, I hit the snooze. But apparently now it's good till two o'clock with a bit of rain, and I won't be able to stay out that long anyway. So hopefully, I'm gonna have a good walk. See how the hut's coming along now? One piece of the roof has been put back on. The original, well, the old roof, you know, that was pulled off. They put the gates on with a big padlock. It's important to protect all the rubbish inside. And by the look of it, nothing at all has been done on the other side. Let's have a look from the other side. No, no repairs to the roof at all or the graffiti. And there, are propped up against the uh, wood is part of the roof, which they haven't bothered to get and put on. So let's just hope it's a work in progress. Work in progress, and we're gonna see more in the future.
So this is the gate taking you across the tracks. And there used to be a big padlock here, which has been removed. So you can just go across now, open it up without having to... I mean, you can still jump over a course in the past if you wanted to. But they did have a method of saying at least it's locked. Right, Dorothy's diamonds. Cernhay's <laughs> Castle. Well, that was the sea wall, but it looks like we've got plenty of wind in Timmouth, unfortunately. So I'll have a little wander along the seafront. But if it's really blowy like this, I probably won't feel very much. Well, I've decided not to go along the seafront, just get blown away. Although it's not much better here, but I'm going to walk just into town, Triangle area. I think there's a little market on. And um, we'll go from there, really. Again, it's if it's um, really windy, well, I'm not going to. Not gonna fit. There is one of the little markets going on. So you get smaller each time I come down to be fair. The meat. Gluten free. Sweets and savouries. Goat. Artisan goat cheeses, veggie deli, gluten free, no cholesterol stuff, tempeh, some shoot fruit produce, jams and swashes, plants, some sort of cakes or pies. There we go, that's the little market. I haven't even got the uh, cakes down there that I frequent sometimes. Never mind. Coasters Cafe. Some sort of a political thing. Team Bridge. And brunch. And of course Luders, which you can't quite see the sign up in the background with the cakes. Oh, the Timber Social Club used to be the British Legion many, many moons ago. up along Orchard Gardens towards the Baptist Church. I'm surprised that that statue has lasted as long as it has. So it ends up on top of the pier or something, you know. No need to visit Lidl's today. But I will be making a a visit tomorrow, I think. Well, there we go. I enjoyed that. Just a sea wall and a little bit of the town, but very nice anyway. Weather held up. Off up home now to see my family, which will be nice. And I'll catch you tomorrow. Same time, same place. Thanks for watching. Bye.